Welcome everyone to Mets Baseball Recap for Tuesday, June 15th. And we start things off with a huge plus because the Mets defeat the Chicago Cubs 3-2. And Walker, Taiwan Walker, earned his sixth win of the year. Um, pitching seven innings and giving up only two runs with 12 strikeouts. The two runs were hit, came off uh, a home run by Bias in the third inning. With one on, one out. Um, but besides that, he 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 made them look silly. Um, no, and there's a lot to talk about in this game. There's so many um, aspects. The Mets had eight hits in this game. Everyone basically had a hit except for Pilar and Walker. Uh, even Lugo got a turn and bat, and he went 0 for 1. But, no, the Mets' uh, bullpen had a night off, basically, because Lugo came in and gave him two innings. The first inning he pitched in relief was uh, smooth as butter. The second inning was a little tense. And he had some assistance to the Mets, uh, Mets uh, the Cubs third base coach, Harris, who made a bonehead decision to send Marisnik, uh home on a base hit. Um, and, you know, he, he got from first to third and then tried to take home. He waved them in and they threw him out. Pilar did a great job. He cut that ball off. It was in the gap. He cut it off, threw it back in. Guillaume then threw the ball to McCann. McCann tags out um, Meniznik at home. And it was a beautiful play in the sense that, oh, my God, the Mets were about to be one. No, the Mets were about to face the Cubs with first and third one out. Instead, now we have runner on second with two outs. Uh, Lugo would then walk the next batter and then strike out the rookie, um, um, uh, Cantada, not Cantada, Oof, I'm not putting you in that terribly, but he struck him out, um, and, uh, earned a, a two inning save. Um, so good job on Lugo on that one. Now, uh, Diaz had the night off. And I love how the commentators try to twist this because they're like, he pitched three of the last four games. No, he didn't pitch Sunday. He pitched yesterday. He, he earned his 13th save. He could have pitched today. There's no reason why he could have. But, you know, it, it worked out. If it didn't work out, people would have been screaming and bitching and complaining. I would have been for sure. Um, now, I did say, no, I didn't want to see May in this game. Um, May had just been too too shaky. It's, I, I, don't, I don't feel May right now. I don't feel confident. And bringing Trevor May. Uh, not sure what's going on with Trevor May, but you know, it's just what it is. On the offensive side, the Mets had eight hits, and like I said, only Pilar was the only batter that didn't get a hit. Um, but let's talk about how the Mets uh, tied this game in the third. Um, Francisco Lindor will get on base due to a fielder's choice. Smith, I believe, earned a walk, and then Pete Alonso will drive them both in. No, it was a. I think he had a double actually, if I'm not mistaken. Let me just double check this because I don't, I don't want to get bad information. Yeah, uh, Dominic Smith hit a double to make it a second and third, and then Smith, uh, then uh, Smith, Alonzo. Shoot, I can't even talk right now. I'm tired, as you can tell my voice, and uh, I still don't have my setup back yet. But hopefully, hopefully by the weekend we'll be good to go. But uh, P. Alonzo drove in the two runs in the third to tie the game. And then in the bottom of the fifth inning with the bases loaded, uh, Pete Alonso will hit a sacrifice fly to drive in the winning run. Pilar will score in that. So the first three batters of the Mets lineup scored one run apiece. So good job on the Mets offense there. Um, but like I said, I think the assist goes to Harris, the third base coach for the Cubs who sent Menesnik. Whoo, man, that was scary. I was like, What's, why is he sending him? That's a bad play and a throw home. I'm like, oh. Good job on uh, McCann to get that tag in because, you know, on pond replay, it was closer than it, it should have been. Uh, the, the ball was there. It just it, He was dead. He was a dead duck. Guys, the Mets win, and the Mets are now nine games over 500, 34th and 25. And tomorrow, the Mets take on the Cubs for game three of the four-game series. And, and Jacob DeGrom will pitch for the Mets tomorrow. So any fears that he was injured, it's gone. He's he, he's pitching tomorrow. So it should be a good game. Uh, it's a 7-10 start. And uh, let's go Mets. Let's go Mets.